In July of this year, the Florida Department of Transportation will begin its westbound Okeechobee Boulevard to southbound I-95 bridge rehabilitation and painting project in the city of West Palm Beach. This project will consist of routine maintenance of the ramp connecting westbound Okeechobee Boulevard to southbound I-95. Improvements include painting the steel and concrete portions of the bridge ramp connecting westbound Okeechobee Boulevard to I-95 and minor repairs to the bridge drainage system. The project will start on July 2nd of 2020 with lane closures expected to begin in late July and is anticipated to be completed by spring of 2021 at an estimated cost of $1,246,700. Traffic impacts may include I-95 main line lane closures and full northbound and southbound on-ramp closures from 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. Sunday through Thursday and lane closures on Okeechobee Boulevard from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. Sunday through Thursday. Detours will be provided during full ramp closures to direct motorists to I-95 on-ramps via U-turns at Church Street and Parker Avenue. The detour route for westbound Okeechobee Boulevard to southbound I-95 closure will include traveling west on Okeechobee Boulevard, then making a U-turn at Church Street followed by taking the southbound ramp on the I-95. The detour route for eastbound Okeechobee Boulevard to northbound I-95 closure will include traveling east on Okeechobee Boulevard, then making a U-turn at Parker Avenue, followed by taking the northbound ramp on the I-95. For more information, please contact FDOT Project Manager Kevin McCochi at 561-370 1146 or Community Outreach Specialist Angel Garner at 561-886-8773.